What's going on guys, Malfic here, back with another video. Today I will try out the application called Bacti. Bacti is an application especially for PUBG Mobile which unlocks and enhances more graphical options. Um, using today the global PUBG Mobile version 9.5. The device I'm using today is the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4X. It has Snapdragon 625 and free gigs of RAM. Alright, let's go to the app here itself. And now we do have some options we really um, can adjust. So um, the Snapdragon 625 is a mid-range chip, so I'm gonna try out um, some graphics which should work uh, graphical-wise and FPS-wise quite good. So the graphics quality will be HD, the shadow quality will be medium, the resolution uh, will stay at low, the render distance is also medium, the color style this time will be realistic, some of you guys asked me to do that. And the moving shadows are also enabled. Um, the frame rate is 60, the rendering quality is high, the light effects are medium, uh, anti-lasing is disabled, lightning, eff lightning effects is also on medium, and texture quality, why not, let's turn that to high. Alright, then hit basically just apply and advertisement just as it states will start pretty soon let's lower the volume up a little bit down a little bit and then basically just quit the advertisement and hit run game itself. Okay guys now we are at the main menu um, as you can see I skipped a little bit because this really does take up some while after you uh, load back T up with PUBG and yeah let's go to the settings and uh, check what those graphics are and as you can see the graphics are on HD the frame rate is on extreme main menu theme is classic style effect is just like mentioned on realistic uh, brightness brightness let's crank that up to the maximum and auto adjust graphics is disabled it's pretty important that you disable this because if the device or the game sees the device struggles it will automatically turn down everything Okay, um, basically that's that. We don't have any more options we really can adjust. Uh, let's high up the volume. I wanna, well, at least I only can play a rungle. Let's go with a solo game here and just hit start game itself. And as for my newest viewers, guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell as I'm releasing new videos every day with different devices and different games. So hit the bell to stay tuned. <clears throat> so uh, the Note 4X is a uh, still pretty good budget device by Xiaomi. As you can see it has the old uh, screen aspect ratio, there is no notch, no nothing. This is your basic 5.5 inch screen. Uh, you can't really go wrong. And I don't know what Xiaomi um, did else, um, did, some, did something different back then, but I have to say the um, screen really um, I don't know, it's a little bit better. At least the colors are more popping out and I do like that contrast quite a bit more than the newest Xiaomi devices have. I'm really not sure if uh, Xiaomi really did use back then other display panels and so on. But yeah, it's pretty comfy to hold. It has a big 4100 mAh battery in it. So compared with the Snapdragon 625, you'll have a great gaming. Um, well, you, at least let me tell you that you can play for longer sessions without loading up and so on. And yeah, as you can see, um, it does really run quite fluid. The graphics also do look uh, quite good too. Let's jump out somewhere randomly. And this video is in 60 FPS, so if you experience any major frame rate drops, you guys can also see that too. But till now, it looks pretty okay. What exactly is this here? This is, uh, is this the mansion? Oh, 
I think it looks like it. Yes. Uh, let's look a little bit around. And also the Node 4X um, did uh, got the latest MIUI 10 patch or um, update, which really um, improves the overall usability and fluidness. And yeah, overall it really um, does look quite nice, I have to say. Better than I expected overall. Back to really does a great job here. Alright, level 2 backpack, Molotov, alright, uh, skip that. Well, let's look a little bit more around looks like there is somebody I don't know Um, there are probably again uh, quite a bit of bots as um, this is this isn't my main account so I wouldn't be surprised that um, there are quite some bots uh, you can really see that um, by their behaving Farm grip, all right. So, um, yeah, realistic, I have to say, um, does look really good on that screen. The car, the colors are um, quite popping out a little bit more than I'm used to. I like it. I really like it. I'm still gonna stick with the Uzi here just for fun. And I do have the silencer with me. Looks like there is somebody. And again. Let's take the UMP here instead of the Uzi. All right, uh, let's go outside of the area and let's find or let's search for a car to demonstrate you guys the performance with uh, while driving around. Okay. It really doesn't look like it. That there is anywhere a car I can jump into but yeah still the performance is quite stable no major frame rate drops I can experience right now do I have a no and still no scope to try it out also 
anyways. But yeah, um, I don't know. It really does look like that Xiaomi did something else back then uh, with their displays. I don't know, it's just more crisp in some way. I absolutely like um, those displays of those older devices more. The uh, Mi Max 2 also has the same display, or at least uh, those crisp displays. Yeah, the colors are just more popping out. That's why. That's what I really love about uh, those colorful displays. Okay, there should be actually something around because there's always uh, at least a bike or something to drive around, but it really doesn't look like it. Mm, I think I'm seeing a bike. Or something. All right, let's uh, quickly drive around. Yeah, it's uh, still pretty fine. No frame rate drop really. Well, all right, guys. I think this should be enough to get you a quick overlook how the. Note 4X performs with back T on the latest PUBG mobile patch of the global version. Have a good one. Thank you a lot. And don't forget to subscribe to see new videos every day. Bye, guys.